What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day today and I hope you guys had a great holiday. We are back playing some Pokemon Sword and Shield, hopping onto that ranked double ladder with this amazing weakness policy Reggie Rock team. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Shout out to my boy Joe for dropping the team. I cannot wait to get after it with these guys. But rocking out in our front spot is my boy Reggie Rock. Pokemon we haven't used yet. This thing is clear body, weakness policy item, and then amazing moveset of Iron Head, Rock Slide, Body Press, and Protect. Pheromos on the right side is going to pair well with Reggie Rock after we get that weakness policy trigger. We can also coach it up with the coaching move. We got speed swap so we can get Pheromos' fast speed over to Reggie Rock, have that thing absolutely get after it. Then we got close combat and ice beam as nice hitting and coverage moves. Behind my face cam, we got the one, the only Garchomp, Dragon and Ground type. This thing's such a beast with EQ, Iron Head, Rock Slide, and Dragon Claw. And then Sand Veil as it's a... Uh, as it's ability that will pair well with uh, Reggie Rock. If, you got, if I go for a Max Rock Ball, Sand Bell can uh, proc. And then we got that Assault Fest so we can eat up special attack. Over on the right side, we got Thunderous. This thing is Life Orb with Defiant. Can kind of counter up on some Intimidate Pokemon. So they have Intimidate. We're going to get out Defiant Boy. Try to boost our attack and roll from there. So he has Wild Charge, Fly, Super Power, and Protect. Bottom left corner, my boy Rotom Heat. This thing has been seeing a lot of spotlight since Series 7 comes out. You can counter up on those Metagrosses and those Glaciaries, which are two very, very strong Pokemon in the meta right now. It has Levitate, Citrus Berry, and the normal moveset of that Overheat, Thunderbolt, Nasty Plot setup, and Protect. Then in the final spot, a lovely little support mon with Comfy with the Triage ability, Mental Herb, Ally Switch, Trick Room, Floral Healing, and Giga Drain to actually proc Reggie Rocks. Weakness policy. If you guys want to use this team for yourself, rental code is at the bottom of the screen, but let's get after it. Let's hop onto that rank double ladder, try to get some wins with this team. Look at this dude's team. This dude is absolutely stacked up. I went to go try to do rank battles, but Reggie Rock over here wasn't battle mark ready, so we're hopping into casual. And I read a lot of you guys' comments saying you guys don't really mind me doing casual battles. You guys still watch content and enjoy it anyway, so that is exactly what we're going to be doing. This guy is stacked with the three legendaries from Sword Shield Xerneas. Zamazetta and Zacian right here. Big powerhouse Pokemon. He also has a competitive Milotic. Beware and Mudsdale on his team. I think I'm just going to try to get after with the Reggie Rock combo. Get Comfy in there and then get Faramosa to maybe uh, go for a speed swap. And then in the final spot, probably bring Garchomp because Garchomp's an absolute beast. You can roll out and do some work. I think, I think that's the play. I think that's the play. Let's get after it. Let's get after it, right? Or, but aren't both those Pokemon fairy typings? Zamazetta and Zacian? I believe so. So maybe not Garchomp. Nah, I still want Garchomp here. I, I love Garchomp. I'm gonna get Garchomp in here. Where do I go with Thunders? Thunders with that life orb could be huge. Nah, we're gonna go Garchomp. We're getting Garchomp after this. We're gonna try to eat up this first battle and take out all these legendaries. I do love playing on casual. If you guys do not know, casual is just tons of fun because it's always something different. It's not like uh, everyone's using the same meta Pokemon with the same items, this, that, this, that. Like you guys already know what I'm talking about. Like, we're gonna go up against some legendaries and actually have some fun with it. And sometimes we get dumped on by legendaries because, again, they are legendaries and these things are powerhouses and they're banned from rank for a reason. And he's got double lead dogs, dude. Double leading dogs are killing me. Shiny Reggie Rock is out here. He's out here, ready to go. Um, how do I play this one? Got oh my god, dude. He's already boosting attack. And this thing is gonna boost his defense. <laughs> Bro, what do you want me to do? This thing's stacked. Alright, we getting after it. Uh do I Do I steal spike? Oh, we steal spike on you. We're getting that defense boost. I'm gonna just giga drain. Got floral healing too. Gonna get a drain, proc weakness policy, and then just start floral healing my boy or ally switching. Let's see how this works. Get it, let's get it. This guy, ooh, this guy master ball is what you are. No, it's because it was shiny. I would master ball too. Like, hey, get over here. I'm not, I'm not losing you. Got a master ball. Thing. Look at it. I think there's a way to get more master balls in this game. Like, they're not like you get like two now. It's like there's ways to get multiple master balls. I forget how, how you do it, but there's a way. Giga drain's popping here. Built. And we getting after it. They probably outspeed me. I hope not. I hope not. But Reggie Rock, I don't think he's that fast of a Pokemon. Let's see what happens here. Yeah, he's gonna go for Sacred Sword. E. We eating, baby. Actually, I didn't even need that. I can Floral Heal the next turn all day. He's gonna go for a Behemoth Bash. This might take me out, which I'd be fine with. I wouldn't be too mad because I can get Faramosa in here and Speed Swap. Oh my God, yo! Look at this move. Look at that move. The Comfy eat. Yo, Comfy ate up. That's lovely. That's lovely. I'm actually Steel Spike here. Get the defense boost. This is probably gonna take him out. Yeah, right? Yeah, get him out of my face. Get out of my face. I'm sick of you. I'll floral healing up on the uh, Reggie Rock. And then I'll just, uh, we'll just roll out. We'll just roll out. Because once Comfy goes down, we get Faramosa and we speed swap. Or we just coaching it up. Bro, we chill. We chill. These legendaries can't handle the Comfy combos. Dude, Comfy is the best. I love Comfy. Little, little Hawaiian Lei necklace. 
He's just an absolute beast. He's just an absolute beast. Cannot be tamed. Cannot be tamed. Xerneas is popping here. He's gonna put on the pressure. That's fine. I really don't care about pressure. That doesn't really affect me too much. I could knuckle. I could knuckle buckle up. Get an attack boost here. I kind of rather set the. Actually, I can set the Saiyan next turn. My guard chop. We'll just get the attack boost here and we'll just throw healing up. Say, like, hey yo, Reggie Rock. Have some health, buddy. Have some health. We chilling here. These legendaries don't stand a chance. This person's like just thinking like I'm gonna hop into the casual ladder with these top tier legendaries and just run things. Like, nah, yeah. You don't know that Jeans is up in the casual ladder, playing some matches, ready to roll out. Because of floral healing. Floral healing is awesome, dude. It actually heals up a good bit. Xerneas is gonna use his beam. Kind of just takes off what we uh, did with floral healing. And Behemoth Bash just come out here. That's totally fine. I, I want a comfy to go out anyway. Yo, this animation for every time he uses it? <laughs> every time he uses it. That's the easy comfy. You did work. Proc weakness policy. Kept my boy alive. And now we're going to be able to drop a big old max up. Get Faramosa out here. Or do I get? Yeah, let's get Faramosa out here. Faramosa, yeah. I don't think he's going to take him out, though. Let's see. Yeah, no. Not stab. I just want that attack boost. Um, I think if I speed swap, do we, do we outspeed them? Do we outspeed them? Get Faramos out here. I don't know, like, these Pokemon are fast. They're fast, and we know that. So I'm thinking, like, even with the speed swap, Pokemon might still be faster, but I'm gonna go for it anyway, just to see. Just to see, so. Go for the Rock Fall. I'm gonna go after you. I'm plus, I'm, I'm plus, uh, what am I plus? I'm plus three. That should be able to take out Xerneas, Xerne no problem. I'm gonna speed swap here. Okay, so Faramosa is the fastest. Beautiful. Regirock is now the fastest. Regirock is gonna go. Beautiful speed swap. You'd love to see it. Get some big damage stab here too. Yeah, yo, get out my face. Get out my face, yo. I'm sick of you. I'm sick of you. Dump that thing up. Get my sand rolling. That's gonna that's gonna thrive for my Reggie Rock and my uh and my boy Garchomp when he gets out here. Cause I think he might take out Faramosa here. Unless you're gonna go. No, you're gonna go after my Reggie Rock. Should be able to eat this one up. Reggie, you got this, buddy. You got this all day. And you are now the fastest. So all you gotta do is eat the shot and you're thriving. My boy, my boy eats up. My boy eats up. I love those legendary. I love I love uh, Zamazed and Zacian. I think they look so cool. I think they're such cool Pokemon. All right, so Faramosa's sash is going because of the Sandstorm. I saw that coming. And then he's gonna go into Milotic, which Milotic might get the Dynamax. Might get the Dynamax. If they're gonna Dynamax, he's gonna be on you. I think I just Rock Slide. I could Body Press. They see you later, but I think I'm gonna Rock Slide, do some damage on that Milotic, and I think I just Close Combat drop you. I think that's the play. I think that's the play. The close combat dropped uh, Zamazetta. And what's called should come out here first. It's gonna be this rock side. He's gonna Dynamax Mouth again. This one's gonna be super close now. It's gonna be super close. Oh, you're gonna change up the weather, maybe. Please don't change up the weather. This one's gonna be super, super close. Super close now. I'm kinda scared, yo. I'm kinda real scared. Hopefully, we get the flinch on that thing. Let's see, rock side. Hey. Oh, we doing damage on the Mouth. Give me the flinch on Zamazetta. Give it to me. Bro, can I get it? There goes my Reggie Rock. I think that's double kill. I think this dude just ended it. This dude just ended it. It's game over. What you mean? Legendaries are coming up clutch. Yeah, he goes after. He, he, if he took out, I thought he was taking out uh, Reggie Rock, but if he just took out one of my Pokemon, he missed Bash. He's doing absolute. He's doing absolute work. Here comes a guy. He's changed up weather. That, that's not a good for us. He definitely has Hailstorm off his sleeve. That's going to take out my Rock. Reggie, no! <laughs> I thought we were I thought we were just gonna be able to pile through this one, but man dude. These legendaries are banned for a reason. They're really, really strong, they're really fast, they they can bulk up shots. Ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Get out Garchomp. And man, if I would have brought Thunderous, we would have been thriving. Actually no, Ice would have still dumped on it. We do have the assault vest, which is pretty nice. My boy Garchomp. He's shiny, he looks normal. My boy looks normal. We're just gonna drop EQ because that's stab. I know we outspeed the Milotic. I don't think we outspeed that, uh, that Zamazetta. I don't think we do. I don't, I don't think so. We'll see. We'll give it a peek. We'll give it a peek. Oh, we do outspeed. Take him out. Take him out. Bro, what you mean? What you mean? This thing has Moonblast and our grand move doesn't even take him out. I know he's plus one. We still eat that up. That Assault Vest. That Assault Vest is lovely. And of course you're going to get the drop, but we're physical. So here comes the geyser. Can we eat that? Can we eat that with the soul fest? We can. All right. But we need a crit on you. We need a crit. We need a crit. We need a crit on the Milotic. 
To win this game, we need to crit on the Milo Only way, only way to win this one. We need to crit on the Milo 3. Come on, baby. Come on, Garchomp, clutch it up for us. What you got, kid? What you got? No, we don't we don't get the crit, man. We don't get the crit. That's gonna be GG. That's gonna be GG. So very close match, first one. Definitely would have won that one if he didn't bring top three legendaries, you know? That are not allowed in rank for a reason. But yeah, we still I I think we played that one very, very well. I think if we played that one on the rank ladder, I feel like the way we set up and everything we did with the speed swap, we would have probably just absolutely dominated the battle. Second battle coming at you guys. This guy has Galarian Slowbro, Rillaboom Charizard, so two very, very strong starters. Zavora, which is an amazing fast electric Pokemon physical attack. He's got Mew as well. Ooh, no, I don't know what to expect from Mew and Reggie Draco. We, we already know a lot about Reggie Draco. The thing's an absolute beast. Um, How should I roll out here? I could go Landers. I could, or not Landers, Thunders. Thunders is not looking too bad here. I can just dump on the Charizard. I don't think that thing is, uh, we are defiant, but I don't think that uh, Zavora is Lightning Rod. Um, hmm. I really want to go. Reggie Rock is Reggie Rock's pretty tough here. I think I go maybe Reggie Rock and Comfy Lead, and then bring Garchomp and uh, Thunders in the back end. I think that's pretty good. Go Comfy, Thunders, and Garchomp. Cause I feel like if I didn't bring Faramosa in the last battle, and I brought Thunders instead. We totally would have won that one. So instead of going uh, two support mods, we're number one, one with the Comfy, and then just three big attackers up in the front line, and try to pick our up our first one for this video. But who is he going to lead? He might. Uh, hopefully, he leads something cool like Mew. The war we already know a lot about. It. I, I kind of want to see Mew in this battle. There's Mew. Oh, this guy's hacked, isn't he? With PokeGens.com, isn't that a hack hack thing? PokeGens.com. That's like a, a, every time like someone's name or Pokemon's name is like a .com, it's like a hack. Thing. But yeah, yeah, we're going up against a hacker. We're going to slap up on him. <laughs> He's getting his hacked Pokemon. Ooh, ooh, I'm a D-Max here. I'm going to drop the Charizard because I ain't playing around. I really am not playing around. And I'm going to just, I'm just do this. I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to proc policy. I'm going to say Charizard. Hey, hey, Charizard. Come on, get out of my face. That's what we're going to do. I don't think Charizard is going to be able to kill us. Not a shot. Reggie Rock is really bulky. And... I'm guessing the only movie he really has to take me out is going to be Max Overgrowth, and it's not Stab. So my boy should be able to eat it up. And I should be able to take this out in one shot with the weakness policy, Rock Stab. It should be, should be out of my face. It should just be the Johnson. But maybe I shouldn't have went for the Giga Drain, considering he's probably just going to go for a Overgrowth. But maybe, no. I don't know what I would have went for. Maybe just a Giga Drain over on the view. Do a little bit of damage, but now nah, I'm gonna proc my own with this policy. Let's see what happens. Let's see what, let's see if he was gonna go for the overgrowth. Here comes my Giga Drain. Mwah. Give me that policy. Trigger that. Trigger that bad boy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And he's gonna go for a what are you gonna go for? An overgrowth, yes. So he is gonna go for the overgrowth. I believe we should do it. Oh, over on Comfy Slot. You think I was ally switching? I'm very glad on my play. I'm very, very happy on that play. That's totally fine, yo. Here we go, guys. Charizard, do me a favor. Wait, we gotta wait for Mew to go. He's gonna go for Psychic. Comfy should be able to eat that up as well. Yeah, cool. And they are gonna get special defense drop. But yo, Charizard, do me a favor. Mwah, out my face. Get out of here. Get him out of here. He's done, so. He's done, so. Yo, Reggie Rock, showing who's boss, man. <laughs> he just dropped a whole rock slab on a flying dragon, dude. He was like, Mwah, get out of my face. This was his rock. <laughs> just right on him. I love Max Rock Ball. It just comes up and just slams on down. Everything else is like something cool, like a big like fireball or big water geyser, big dragon spirals, but this one's just not. Nah, giant rock slide fall right on top of somebody. <laughs> but the grass terrain is going to neglect uh, the, the sand damage, which is fine by me. Totally fine by me. Um, I'm not really worried about the Mew. I'm really not worried about the Mew at all. Doesn't seem like it's doing too, too much. It's gonna psychic. But it's Draco on the other hand. All right, now uh, now nah, nah, it's a little scary. Uh, ch 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 I rock fall. Do I get a boost? I just want to rock fall and say, "See you later, Reggie Draco." At the same time, I kind of want a defensive boost. But now nah, we're just gonna, uh, we're just gonna rock fall, say, "See you later to you." And then I'm just gonna Giga Drain. I'm not even gonna ally switch. Just gonna Giga Drain on the Mew. Get first turn priority. Try to get some HP back. Giga Drain. Oh. And it's in the grassy terrain, so we get a little bit more damage. A little bit more than what we normally do. I have to get some HP back. Hopefully, you can eat a shot. Probably not. It's like it's going to roll through, right? 
Yep, Seki's gonna drop my Confi. That's that's fine. Confi already did his job. I can bring out Thunders, but I think I'm gonna bring out Guard Because we do have the Sand Veil, the lovely little Veil of Sand. Dragon Energy, energy can come through. Dragon Energy, out my face. Out my face, yo. Get it out of my face. <laughs> we should come in here and say, yo, Reggie Draco. Out of here. Get him out. <laughs> You're trash, kid. You're trash. <laughs> He's gonna take some buffets, but once again, the Grand Surge is gonna take over. Then I, I'm gonna bring out Garchomp and finish up this battle. Garchomp thrives with the Sand Veil. I can drag a claw across. If that stab damage is still rolling, and have just Thunder is chilling. So, second battle is looking really, really good in our favor. He has one other Pokemon, which is probably gonna be Zymax Pokemon. Is it Zorora? Is it gonna be Zorora? I wouldn't be surprised, and I would absolutely love it. Yeah, it is. It is. Because, yeah, we got my boy Charizard, or not Charizard, Garchomp out here. He's just gonna counter up on that. Uh, do I guard? I want to drop a ground move, but then at the same time, I don't want to. But I'm just going to steal Spike Across on you. And then I think I just EQ and end this battle. Nah, nah, nah. We're going to Dragon Call. We're going to Dragon Call over onto this Aurora. I don't want to take out my Reggie Rock. Aurora's going to go for close combat. And yo, that's a tasty snack you got there. That's a real. That was the tastiest close combat I've ever eaten up. That was super tasty, man. Here comes my Dragon Claw. Mwah. Oh my god. I almost dropped it. Mew Psychic's going to pop here. Garchomp Sandvale coming up clutch. We get the dodge. Love to see it. Because my seal spike. Mew, Mew out of my face. What? You survive, but I think Buffets come out first. I think Buffets do come out first. Alright, Buffets come out first, and then the, uh, yeah, Buffets come out. We get double kill with Buffets? No. The Jimmy Buffets, man. <laughs> the Margaritavilles, we're gonna start calling them. <laughs> any any Buffets, we're gonna start calling them either Jimmy Buffets or Margaritavilles. I think, I think it's such a great name. I think that is such a good name. You guys get the reference. You guys know who Jimmy Buffett is. It's kind of self-explanatory. But <laughs> that's what we're going to start calling it. The Jimmy Buffett. Or the uh, or the Margaritavilles. Whatever you guys want to call it. You guys can decide in the comments section down below. I kind of like that one. I kind of like coming up with like little funny things like that. But I'm just going to EQ drop this one. And finish off this battle for... Oh, he's just going to cancel. That's totally fine. You cancel it. We're going to hop to our third and final battle. We'll try to get a winning record. Final battle going up against a very, very strong Series 7 team right here. I've seen this on the ladder multiple times. It's Regilecki, Duskop, Spirit Trick Room, Tapu Fini, Landris for that Intimidate drop. He's also got Glaring Moltres and a Trick Room Staka Taka. Okay, so we can roll out multiple different ways. I feel like uh, what's called Death Lance Come, Thunderous, because it has Define ability and he might lead a Landris. So I think I might actually lead the boy right here, the Thunderous, and then roll in with Garchomp as well. I feel like that's just a solid lead. Just them two getting rolling there. I don't think we really bring Reggie Rock to this battle. I think we, maybe we bring Rotom Heat. Mm, we bring Rotom Heat. I think Faramosa can come in here. Maybe we do bring Reggie Rock. Do I bring the Rock Seeds? What do I really want here? This one's tough. Get the Moltres. I think I bring the Rock. We can do some work onto that Glaring Moltres who might get in here. And then maybe Confi in the back. Or do I bring Faramosa with the Sash? Faramosa's not bad. He's got the close combat. Or Stab. And you also got to, we're going to go, go Faramosa here. We are going to go Faramosa in the final spot and try to get ourselves that win for the online gaming community, baby. The Jeans online gaming community, baby. We looking for it. We trying to get it for you guys. Um, Hopefully he leads. If he leads Landers, I'm just going to Dynamax my Thunders and just say, Mwah, out my face. Get him, let's get rolling here. That's what's awesome about uh, Thunders is it's electrotyping, so ground super effective, but it's also flying, so ground zone effective. That's, that's just awesome. That is just totally awesome. Well, let's roll it. Let's run it. Let's get after it. Let's see what he got. Let's see what he's got. Who you leading? Show me Landy. Show me Landy. Money, please. Money, please, baby. Let's get it. Defiant coming out here. Garchomp, I'm going to just swap you out. Swap you out of here. Swap you out. I could go for an EQ. I, I might double up into the Taka Taka slot. Defiant coming out here. What plus one do I I, I should die next year. Gotta get that Intimidate drop. You gotta do it. You gotta do it. I don't care. I do not care. I dropped just a superpower right here. Hmm. There was the user's attack. Oh, I don't just want to die. I'm actually for Knuckle. Put an airstream. It's not very effective on it. Ah, what do I want to do? Are even Dynamax? I don't want to start boosting speed, so I'm going to go after this lander slot. I mean, he might. Hmm. I think I dropped an EQ. I might. Do I, where do I swap you? I kind of don't want to start boosting speed. That'd, that'd be a problem. I kind of... Because if he, uh, Trick Rooms, I'm just lightning over on you, and I might see Lander swap. I think I'm going to, uh, EQ here. I'm going to keep Garchomp in. Let's just do some damage on Sakataka. Let's see, let's see how he plays this one out. 
We maxing. We maxing. No, we're plus one on the field, which is huge. It, it, it usually goes plus two, but since it's a uh, defiant, it goes minus one first, and then it adds to plus two, which puts us at just plus one, which is still phenomenal. Which is still huge. Under a Dynamax here, we're getting after this thing is life orb as well, so we're gonna get that uh, multiplier. I think it's one point three. And we are the fastest on the field, so we don't even really need that uh, max session, which is huge. We're gonna be able to do some big damage here. And I think Garchomp, even though it is minus one, it still should be able to drop this thing with an EQ, which is gonna be lovely, lovely. And I know uh, Sakataka is gonna be the slowest one on the field. I think it's going for a trick room regardless, so. Let's see, EQ comes out. Not gonna affect Landers or Thunders. Totally fine. And this thing has a berry, dude. It has a berry. If it gets off trick room now, I'm gonna be so mad. Get him out of here. Yes, let's go. Let's go. We still end up getting it out of there. We catch the crit. We catch the crit. Thank you very much. Mwah. We catch the crit. The lucky crit kind of helps us out there. And Rock Slide's going to pop here. That's totally fine. That's totally fine. I'm going to have to get rid of this, uh, this lander set over here. He's doing some damage on me. Let's see who he actually brings in. He might bring him maybe Moltres? No way he brings him. There's no way he brings him Moltres. If he brings him Moltres, it's done. I'm going to just dump on him. He brings him Moltres. All right. All right, I'm gonna get after it. I'm gonna get after it. I'm gonna just drop, I'm gonna drop a rock side. Uh, I want to drop a dragon claw over on the landers because yo, that Moltres stands no chance. Stands no chance of it staying in. He protects. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. I think I'm still fastest on the field, right? Is my boy still fastest? He's still faster than Moltres. I don't really know. That's still, you know, that's big damage. That is big old damage there. Big old damage. That thing's policy and berserk is proccing. Ooh. E. E. It's a little scary. That's scary. He's plus three now. He's plus three, man. He's plus three. Our time's gonna come across with, with the dragon claw. E. Doing some nice damage. We are minus one. Rock side. We should be able to eat up another rock side. Thunders? I think Thunders outspeeds the Moltres all day. So I think we gotta tell it to go home. I'm gonna just airstream this thing now. And I'm gonna just Dragon Claw up on this thing again. Maybe I should Iron Head to try to get the flinch, but I'm trying to get bigger damage here. Yeah, okay, yeah. Get Moltres out of the way. I'm, I'm not even worried about this battle anymore. Get him out of here! Get him out of here. Plus three Moltres, gone. Out of my face. We get the speed boost again, and then uh, Rock Slide definitely takes out Thunders. But hopefully, hopefully, my Garchomp can survive, or at least maybe Thunders can dodge. That'd be huge if Thunders can dodge. I think this thing might be choice. He's just been Rock Sliding. Might be choice. The Garchomp eats all day. I didn't, I didn't even realize how much Garchomp was eating up. I didn't really look at his HP. But that's that's big for us. Two Pokemon now. Almost three with the Landers. No way Landers can Dynamax. This final mine is going to be a Dynamax Pokemon. And I think I bring out Reggie Rock here. I think we keep Faramosa for the back end because it's Sash. We should, we should slide in later. Let's see who his final mine is. Who is your final mine? It's going to be. It's going to be Regilek. It's going to be Finny. I should have guessed Finny. Finny was like. Pretty solid guess. Okay, so Finny's out here. I still think Garchomp outspeed, so no Dragon Claws allowed because that half the damage for Dragon Moves. Um, cannot go for my EQ either because that's gonna take out my Rock. Um, hmm. let me just Rock Side here. Double Rock Side? Who we deploy looking for flinches, you know? I said we double Rock Side. I probably should have Iron Head in the Landers because Top of Finny is gonna get a Dynamax here. I'd be surprised if he doesn't Dynamax here. We do have Faramosa. I don't know what to think of Faramosa. He doesn't have no bug moves. This is bug typing, but it's not rocking bug moves. It's rocking coaching, speed swap, close combat, and ice beam. Let's see what my dude does. Let's see what you want, fool. His Garchomp is not there. He's still minus one, which is terrible, man. He might actually take the cake. He might take this win. If he Dynamax is Finny here, that's very, very scary, and he might actually take this win. I know Faramosa is faster than the Finny. That's a fact. Here comes the Dynamax. But I need Landers out of here. I need Landers going. If I get Landers out of here, I stand a shot. If not, E. It's going to come close. It's going to come close. But, dude, we really need that Thunders for Finny, dude. Finny's so good. On top of Finny's. Probably one of the best Pokemon. So good. Its, it's moves are awesome. Its stats are amazing. Here comes my Rock Slide. Looking for that flinch on the Lando slot. Lando flies, man. That's whack. That is whack. Stick at this, man. Then he's gonna go for a geyser. Oh, Garchomp, please. Reggie Rod. Alright. Alright. Huh. 
How am I gonna do this? How am I gonna do this? They flew away. We still got Faramosa, so hopefully that fly is going over on my Garchomp side. I had to, if I had to guess, it's going over on my Garchomp out them all. Um. Hmm. Damn it! I got, I gotta, I need the freeze. I need the freeze on you. Or, or we can coach. He's gonna do damage to me, man. Let's see, I need my focus, Ash. I'm gonna have the iron head over on you. We're both faster than that thing, so. Not tough. I'm gonna coach you up. I'm gonna coach you up a little bit. Give you a little whistle. Hey, guard chop! And hopefully, Finny goes after Faramosa. I think that's gonna happen. I think Finny's gonna go after Faramosa. No flies going after Faramosa? That's game, then. Man, he's gonna, gonna start fall. Gonna wrap it up. But I really couldn't do much. I really couldn't do much here. Finny's too good. Finny's too good. What's the Dynamax Finny? That's gonna be GG, man. Some if somehow Faramosa can pull this off, it cannot. Only way Faramosa is pulling this one off, it, it can't. Both of his moves are not very effective against uh, Finny. That's over with. That's over with. And we're gonna actually go one and two for this video. Not too bad. Not too bad. Definitely good battle. So this last battle was uh, really really close. I feel like if he didn't have Finny, like. And the game's over. We won that one. But I'm trying to think, how could I have counted up anything? Like, who else could I have brought in? I mean, maybe keep Thunderous or play that one a little bit different. Keep Thunderous for a little bit longer and make sure that he didn't have Finny. But still, one and two, not bad. Awesome team right here. One last shout out to my boy Joe for dropping this team. I absolutely loved it. The weakest policy, Reggie Rock was so strong once you get that rolling you can just dump on pokemon left and right we also have the defiant thunders which we got to show off a little bit and the speed swap Faramosa, which was awesome paired up with the reggie rock just give them that speed and then that thing is faster than everything but guys that is going to be it for today's video if you did enjoy the content don't forget to smash that like button for me and if you're new here click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you all in the next one peace out everyone